Mark Tuart and welcome to our video series, Why Automotive Dealerships Struggle. In video 19 today, we're going to talk about the lack of processes or the execution of processes. Bar none, every single dealership that I've ever seen, been into, worked with, training, consulting, if they're struggling, if they're doing less than what they should or if they're failing, they have weak to no processes or they just do not execute those processes. What do I mean by processes? Let's start with your selling process. Do you have what I call a routing process? A routing process says, okay, when a customer first makes contact, whether it's internet, whether it's on the phone, or whether it's walking in, or a combination of all three because they started in one and moved to the other, who all is involved, what exactly, and I do mean exactly do you do, what is your sales process for internet, what is your phone process? What is your email process, your texting process? What is it if you do not get them to come in for 30 days, 60 days, 90 days? And when they arrive at that dealership, whether it's an internet customer or somebody just walked in blindly, what do you do with them once they get there? Who all is involved and what are their job descriptions and write it down. That's what I mean by routing process. Everybody must have this. You must communicate it monthly. You must communicate it in all your meetings. It must be written, it must be communicated, it must be clear, and it must be executed, and it must be inspected. If you have a process for cleaning cars, do not assume that your people know what that means. In other words, I would invite you to put together a checklist on what every single thing needs to be done to detail a car in the way that you want. And when it's done, they have to check off each category on a little tear sheet. They have to sign or initial at the bottom and a manager has to inspect the car before it goes into inventory and he has to initial it as well. You say, man, that is quite the attention to detail. The answer is yes. You better have a process that's written, executed, communicated, uh, and inspected on a daily basis for anything in your dealership. If you're going to do a save a deal meeting for your managers, are you going to do it at the same time and are you going to do it every single day? If not, you're doing a wish list. I've been into dealerships, they say, oh, we kind of do it on our own between the managers as we go all day long. It's a small dealership. We know what's going on. You really don't understand the save a deal me. That's not what it's about. I promise you I can dig deals out of your dealership that you're not getting right now. Why? Lack of process. Everything should have a process in your dealership. It does not matter what it is. Delivery process, etc. Go back, review it, write it down. Communicate it, execute it, inspect it. My name is Mark Tuart. Make sure you tune in to the rest of our video series. Go to my website at tuart.com. Get our free email newsletter. Call us anytime at 888 2 tuart And as always, here's to you and good selling.